welcome. Today I'm here with Jimmy Bright, who is a competitor at the New Zealand Ferries Association Heavy Horse Shoeing Contest at the Rotorua AMP Show. Jimmy, how are you today? Good, excellent. Good. Now tell me a little bit more about the Ferries Contest today. What does it involve? Well, it's basically it's a, it's to test their skill as farriers, um, their ability to make shoes, trim freight properly, balance them, uh, nail up, and finish. So although there's a time limit, it's all judged on quality, not time. Okay, so today's contest is strictly heavy horses? No, it's uh, light horses, uh, finished with the heavy horses, um, and shoemaking, forging, yeah, so it's a bit of a mix of everything. Okay, so who is eligible to compete today? Well, basically any, any farrier is eligible to compete. So if they want to come along, yes, they can compete with us. Okay, and how often are these competitions held? Well, we generally have three or four, and probably about five this year. We're going to have a, a, a proper heavy horse competition uh, in a couple of months, and that will be heavy horses all the way through. Judge coming from England, so yeah, we'll, we'll try to have about three, four, five. Fantastic. Yeah. And is it mainly North Island based areas competing today, or are there some boys from South Island? No, we normally have a few come up from the South Island, but uh, none of this, this, this particular competition. Okay. Yeah, we get a few come up. Right, I understand there's a um, apprentice section. Do you have any apprentices for people? Yeah, today? we have apprentices here today, and um, yeah, we always have an apprentice. We have an improvers, so we cater for all the way through to the uh, senior farrier, the okay. open class. Okay, and do you think these competitions help raise the standard of New Zealand farriers? Well, they do because you know you, you, you're seeing the standard of of your peers. Um, and because you've got judges telling you where you might have gone wrong or whatever, then you can correct it. And definitely it helps It helps guys in everyday work they can pick up speed, quality. So yeah, and it just lets you know where you're at. Okay. So if someone was looking at possibly getting into Farrier Reef, how would they go about doing this? Is there a national school? Well, the Farrier Association runs, runs an apprenticeship and we have a, um, a two block courses every year that we, that we run for, you know, as a national school. The hardest part is finding an employer because it's expensive. They have to have a big run. They pay to for an apprentice, and the apprentice has to have horse sense. You know, they have to have an ability to handle horses because it's hard work, and you know, you've got to want to do it. It's very physical too. I it understand. is. It's, it's not a job you think, well, I'll just do it. You've got to want to do it. And, and if and if you you know you enjoy it, great benefits. Great. Thank you very much for your time today. Not a problem.